Welcome back! At the end of the previous part, we got introduced to an artificial blade, but it's missing a few pieces here and there. So, let's get this sorted and speak to Kasser and may maybe buy what we need to buy. Well, hello there. Tora here to buy perfect range sensor and bion connectors. Ah, you're the young Nopon who was gazing longingly at those the other day. Mm-hmm, you noticed? Well, considering you were staring for three hours straight. But I'm dreadfully sorry, we're all out of the perfect range sensor right now. What? We've got plenty of bio connectors still, though. They're 4,000 G apiece. 12,000 for three of them, huh? Uh, really is pretty pricey. Rex Rex promised to pay whole amount, no backsies. I mean, sure, I'm not about to go back on my word, but... Hmm. Are you one of those salvages? Yep. I may not look it, but I'm actually a professional at it. Then maybe you could get a buy and connect it that way. Apparently, they fish the things up quite regularly around the season. Now, that's not a bad idea. Let's give it a try. Good luck, Rex Rex. Rex Rex, yep. I am, um, uh, um, cheer you on. Part one. All right, then receive. Yes. There's other quests around as well, by the way, they've opened up. The real problem is the perfect range sensor. Could we not salvage that as well? So I don't think I've heard of any likely spots for those lately. They're almost impossible to find, except when the titans in the clouds see a line in exactly the right way. And even if we did find a spot where they might show up, we need a lot of luck to actually bag one. We don't exactly have time to waste, so perhaps salvaging isn't the answer. Hey, can I ask you something? On the looks of it, this young lady here is a blade and you're her driver, am I right? Huh? Uh, is that what it looks like? Wait one moment, please. Rex Rex and Tora also blade, actually. Does that make me the driver? Surely the driver would have to be me. Can we try to be a little believable here? We need to sort out our stories. Hey now, no need to get your knickers in a twist. I'm just a regular botanist. Botanist! Toro would never have guessed. I get that a lot. Thing is, I was heading to Leshkam Island for a spot of fieldwork, but I ran into a bit of monster trouble. I tried asking the Imperial Army to help out, but it looks like they're pretty busy right now. So I figured if you lot are decent at fighting, maybe you could take care of the issue for me. If you help me out, I might just be able to spare a perfect rain sensor I've got lying around in storage. Well, that sounds perfect. Yeah, we'll see what we can do. Lashkam Island isn't hard to find. You can see it to the left as you exit the city through the main entrance. Just take care of, of the Jupin Crabble you find there, and be careful. They can be vicious. Okay, part two, cool. Do you want this artificial blade, though? Yes, we do want to activate that. Okay, so... It's got to be pretty close by, isn't it? Let's actually look at our other blade that we got. I keep going to the wrong damn menu. It's just habit. Right, so characters. Let's have a look here. So we maybe should equip something like this. It's like auto attack goes up there. Quite a bit with the wing chip. Critical rate does go up as well. Grand Axe. Very, very lovely, very, very lovely. Okay, so... Let's get the crit up. Hmm. I'll leave the others for now. Let's have a look at her affinity, though. Ooh, hello. I can get stronger still. I know it. Indeed. You know what? I'm gonna use... One of our... Where is it? Love potion thingies. What was it called? Was it love potion? I don't think I'm in the right spot for this. I should be doing it from the um. Ah, I didn't want to do that. Didn't want to. Oh, I've gone to the wrong menu again. Keeps happening. I can't stop it. Okay, so right characters. Let's see here. Let's change that to love source. That's what I'm after. Having this makes me real happy. Mmm, tasty. Indeed. I'm gonna throw, throw the one screw it. I can make them I mean, later. I know it's much later, but happy. you know. Lovely cup of tea. 
Right, so let's go over to Agate now. Really? Guess I didn't unlock it. Feels like a waste now. Ow. We'll deal with it later. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Just wasted them. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, so... Where exactly do we want to go? Let's have a look at the map. So it's going to be... Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope. Back. There. Right, so we want close to there, if anything. May as well use our fast travel to get there. Yeah. So, shall we? We shall. We've still got, like, the enemies not attacking us, etc., which is very, very nice. Ah, yes, this level 9 will be the one after. I've got level 40s all around, and then a level 9. That must be the monster, Sedwin. I was talking about. I think that's Welsh. I don't know how to pronounce Welsh things. Doesn't look like a pushover, that's for sure. Tora Wish could help too, but probably not much good for anything other than decoy or lure. No need for any of that, and we can handle this one just fine, right, Pyra? Absolutely. No need to rely on just my power, though. You should make full use of all your blades. Indeed. You may only have one driver, but twice the blades means twice the potential. Good point, I remember that. Alright, let's do this. Okay, bring it on. I also meant to look at the skills that she had, because I ain't probably looked at the skills. Which is one of the problems. Our emotions are eagle eye! Why not? So I could just auto attack this to death. Like really? It's a word, and I will unleash my fire. Gotcha! Right, there we go. Switch. To the brink. Go Thanks for, for believing it. in me. So I may as well do well, that. It's going smoothly. Keep this up. Excellent. I like your attitude. Lovely. Quick cool. Quick cool. It's like while we're here, I think I do have something for salvage. Like I can salvage, can't I? No, I haven't got any cylinders. I use them all. Okay, let's head on back then. I used the the wrong menu here to fast travel. I don't know. I don't know. Hold off. So we want to go middle-ish. We'll just go to the arch. It's close enough, isn't it? It's close enough. We're here. We're here. So, shall we? I guess we shall. Look at these little quests. We've got one there. Got one over there. There's so many little quests that opened up. Like, oh, jeez. Oh, hey, you're back. I took out that drooping crabble, did you? I knew I made the right call asking you guys. Here's the perfect range sensor as promised. Thank you so much. You've had it lying around since my grandpa's generation, so it's a bit dusty. But it should work just fine. Thanks for all your help. Everything should be fine now. That's that one done, surely. Yes. I need part one done now. Do, 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 do. Oh, come to the finals. Yeah, yeah. Can I just buy that? Whoa! That is quite a bit. I only need three, right? Take that as a yes. So I had the money, so... Q! Alright, so we need to head back now, so... Fast travel menu. Gotta remember that. Okay. Taurus house, let's go! I want this artificial. I need someone else in my group. I can. I, I feel like I'm missing that. We're here. So. I mean so. Oh, lovely bit of rain. Okay, all finished. It's really complete. Very complete. Just need to apply energy charge to activate. Tora, our friend's execution draws near. There's no time to lose. Make haste. I know, I know. Oh, okay, Artificial Blade. It's wakey-wakey time. That won't do, Tora. What, what, what Tora do wrong? You can't keep calling her Artificial Blade. As her creator, 
The least you can do is give her a proper name. Oh, um, well... Actually, friends, Tora did think of name for her. Very good name. Nice. Then I guess there's no problem. Well, why don't you introduce us, Tora? Right away. It's gonna be like, like Frankenstein, it's like, she's alive! Now, wakey wakey! Tora's very own blade! Oh, Poppy! Poppy? Oh. So that's who Poppy is. It is like Frankenstein. Looks a bit like Nisa. <gasps> Poppy? Can you be of service, Master? Oh dear. Oh, 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 wait a minute! Oh, forget you see that! Tora must change the settings. <clears throat> the settings? Uh, this time should be okay. Second time go best. Power on! Greetings, Master Pawn. I... I did it! Taurus! Masterpiece, world's first artificial blade, Poppy! Whoa! Incredible! That is really quite something. Tora did good, huh? You impressed? Tora is a very big success? Absolutely. You're amazing, Tora. Though I was pretty surprised before when she was all, you know. Forget about it. That's not Tora's fault. That was, um, Grampy Pon. Grampy Pon Susu made settings. <laughs> yes, definitely Grampy Pon's fault. Indeed. Are you sure, Tora? Yes, Grampy Pon. <clears throat> yes. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Well, let's not dwell on that. Rex, let's go rescue Nia and Drolark. No time to lose. Meh, meh, indeed. Anyway, my name Poppy. Poppy try hard to make Master Pond proud. I like how her eyes are sort of like they bounce a little. Oh, yeah. That shrew thinks she owns the place. Just because she curries favour with the Emperor. If only I'd got the Aegis myself, I could have returned home in triumph. Or sold her to Banna for a tiny sum. But it's not over. I refuse to let this place be the end of me. I will not be left to rot in this flea-bitten backwater. Captain Patrick! Uh, yes, sir. Double the number of guardsmen. Round up whoever you can find. We're going to find that Aegis before Morag gets her paws on her. So, as you wish, sir. Watch and learn, Morag Ladell. <laughs> Should she be out in the rain? And it is water. Bit risky. Before we leaving, Toro want to explain something to Rex Rex. I keep getting that wrong. Rex Rex and Poppy. Explain what, Master Pon? It about this advanced gaming device. I did wonder what that thing was for. So it's for playing games. Yes, game is called Tiger Tiger. Is hidden gem the Grampy Pon make for Tora when Tora was little Pon? It looks like it's seen better days. Tora turned on power just now, so it should be possible to play. Rex Rex, give game a try. 
Hmm. It does sound kind of fun, but I wouldn't want to get hooked on a game while Nia needs rescuing. Wait, wait, wait. Playing this game can earn prizes, special parts for power up Poppy. Parts for Poppy. Grampy Pon make this game in hopes that it reveal a true purpose when Poppy finally complete. So if friends think Poppy a bit meek, or just want more amazing power, play game and get new upgrade. I guess that makes sense. I'll give it a go then. That is wise decision. Shall Tora explain basics? After all, Rex Rex is a little wet behind ears. Use direction buttons to move. Use A button to attack. So this... So that is basics. Tora let Rex Rex figure out rest by Rex itself. Learning is best by doing... Hmm? Tiger, Tiger, go! Alright then. I'll go with easy because I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Alright, that's some fairly simple then. Ugh. Let's say, can I descend faster? So, okay, as many items as we can then. What do the gems mean though? I was wondering, like, what the hell that was. I don't know. Ow! My, my side! That's the spare life, isn't it? Ah. Ooh, hello. Do I have to get all the way back up? That can be a challenge in itself. Especially at this speed. Ooh. There we go. I think I did alright there. First go. I mean, it was not easy, but you know. Go. I mean, it's obvious. I mean, come on. You have to. It's the rule. Skills of Rex Rex, quite impressive. Rex not pro salvager for nothing. You think so? I think your experience... Well, your experience in salvaging really came in useful. Not that I don't appreciate the compliments, but we should hurry and rescue Nia. Or Naya, however we say it. So, how are we going to get onto that Titan battleship where Nia Naya is being held? As luck would have it, the cloud scene looks to be ebbing just now. We had best aim for the route Pyra mentioned. That route was stretchy, stretching. Just has Gar Garagorm's arch. Okay. From here is easiest to go up to top of stairs, cross bridge, then pass under gate, then you're at Garagorm's arch. And the Ardanian guards, not spotters. Area around Ardanian base, heavily guarded, but up to Gar Gorm's arch sh should be no problem. Alright, let's head there for now. Poppy will do best to help. Let's see about these items that we could clearly have for Poppy then. Ah, alright then. Ah, behold Poppy, the world's first artificial blade. Poppy can't equip box cores, but she has something just as good for customizing her abilities. <laughs> She's dancing. Poppy swap. You can access Poppy swap by going to main character blade swap Poppy, Poppy swap. To make use of the Poppy swap feature, you will need to get hold of certain items via the Tiger Tiger game. Play Tiger Tiger as... <laughs> She's just jumping around. As much as you make Poppy into her best self. <laughs> I love her. She's just dancing around. Alright, anyway. Come out, come out. It's properly off putting, but so cute. Same time. Wrong menu again. Can't even get out of that. It's stuck on the menu for a second. Okay, so we know we had some stuff in the expansion pass for Pop here. Let's see, upgrade parts. This could be good for us. So we've got Tor in the group now. 
the alphas. Hmm. Why can't I get that then? I don't know. Okay, so how much do I have left to get from this lot? It's just that Poppy Alpha's favorite thing, isn't it, really? Everything else I seem to have obtained. Yes, it's just that. Okay, so characters. Let's see here. Let's go to Poppy! Right, so Empower Poppy with collected parts. Manage parts for empowering Poppy. Okay. Just maximize. How much damage can I do? What? Like, seriously. Ah, so it's just the energy converter I'm doing. I need other stuff. It's already set. So accuracy up. Hmm. Infinity extend. Uses damage dealt beast. Uses fire damage. Like the beast hunter one. Yes. 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 It's like, yes. It's just having all these things, it's sort of like, ooh, one chance, one percent chance on fending an insect on attack. So we can get anything else. Oh, because we can have this, the affinity extend then, and the defense up. So what is this doing, like, what's this maximum output, it's like, No idea what that's actually doing, by the way. No idea. I'll leave it at that, though. Because I don't know what I'm doing up there. So, uh, hmm. Oh, no, and there's just stuff here I could have done. Ah, no! I recognize that noise. World of Warcraft. Hmm. Is there anything else we can have here with Poppy? Aquatic Slayer. Back Force. Ooh. I don't like that. I'll go boost. Ah, so we can make her the tank. Okay, so let's see about that. We don't want that. So you got the tank mod already. That's fine. Accuracy up two. Okay. That aggro boost is probably better. Can I get another back force one? Although if she's got aggro, she won't be at the back, will she? So, hmm. Okay, so let's see here. Don't want the aggro down. Flank force, not the side. Ah, front damage, that would be best. If she's getting aggro, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? What else can we get? Alright then, so let's see here. So we're making her into the tank, basically. Maybe I should get another one of those attack from the front. Force. Okay. Let's see about that. Little force. Lovely. So we've made her in like into a super tank. That's the best way of putting it. Screw it, we'll have another one of them. Right, so. Don't know what's going on here. Please trust. Really should have checked that one before I did anything. Because it's like, hmm. Huh. Don't know. Don't know how to get her affinity up. Maybe related to something else, I don't know. I should get this stuff sorted as well. I suppose. We'll leave it for now. So we're still experimenting with this stuff. Is so I'll probably experiment in between the parts at some point. See how I want things to play out. But first, before we go off and do the actual main quest, I do have a quest I want to do. Because there's several quests around. Because I wanted to go to the timber site, didn't I? That's where that one quest that we picked up told us to go. Off we go. What so, will we find? So what I might do is this quest in this part, and in the next part we'll go rescue Nehemiah. 
And then we'll probably have three in the group, and then we'll go do more quests. Just a lot of quests. I'm getting hiccups, that's not good. Huh? Oh, Tucker's got you hunting down the thieves. I've not seen anyone, but I might know something useful. Let's hear the details. Well, it's just some gossip I heard from my husband. Have I been to a place called Siegelfell? You know, down near the rear end of the Gormot Titan? Well, I bet you didn't know there's a little hut by the waterfall, did you? I kind of did. My husband says he saw a pretty big stash of lumber down there. Which is weird, because nobody's supposed to be living there. No. It sounds a tad suspicious, if you ask me. Might be nothing, but it might be something. At any rate, that's all I know. A bit comes in useful, and good luck on your hunt. I'll do what I can. Okay, so... Let's see where we're meant to go now, then. I don't see it on the map. I thought maybe it'd be down there. No, no, no. So where are we going? I need to track it. That's the problem. I get wrong menu again. I'll get used to the menus eventually, I suppose. <laughs> right, so. Right, so. Uh-huh. It's all the way down there, apparently. Oh! Oh, it says up. Oh, was I spent to, meant to speak to people up there? Oh, I suppose I will then. That's what I've got to do. I thought it was that was it and I was just off. Hey, could I ask you about something? So, Tucker's got you looking for timber thieves, has he? Well, he's the kind of guy that makes the sort of thing personal, eh? Makes sense, though. The Titans grow these staggering trees and you don't want all that effort. Good waste so will be taken in vain. That makes sense. Where's Tor? Yeah. Well, I can at least tell you what I know about the thief. It won't take long because I know absolutely nothing. Haha. <laughs> oh, well, he did say haha. <laughs> ah, the look in your face was priceless. Sorry, but the stuff was stolen while the site was closed for the day. So nobody was here to see anything. Might have a tough time fighting any witnesses. But hey, that's not a reason to give up. Keep asking. You never know who will give you a push in the right direction. Don't get it. Here yeah, we get this as well. Come out, come out. A pink one! Right, so... Up, up. See you on the map over there. Huh. Petri! Oh, Tucker's got you hunting down those thieves, has he? Yes, yes. That's our Tucker for you. When something gets to him, he doesn't let it go easily. I know he'd be mad if I hid anything about this, so I'll tell you what I know. Thank you very much. Just the other day, I saw some shady types lurking around here. Looked like they were scoping out the site. Thinking about it now, they could easily have been plotting a theft. You get me? You will never guess who it was, though. Uh. Nopon? Nope. I won't deny plenty of Nopon have a love for money, but I wouldn't peg them as thieves. No, the ones I saw were a bunch of Turkin. Turkin again? There's more than we give them credit for, those Turkin. Some can talk, and they build wooden houses, too. Kind of makes sense that they'd be eyeing up the wood here. Well, I said I'd tell you all I know. Now I have. Good luck with the rest. Okay. So the question is where we go now. It's like... It's like it's over here somewhere where I'm meant to go. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Hello. Tucker. So, how's it going? Anyone have any good leads? Let Tor explain. Hmm, I see. So what you're telling me is, the timber was stolen when the site was closed for the day. I already knew that, though. I hope that the boss would have known something more useful. Triple dot. And you also found out some Turkin have been keeping an eye on this place. Very suspicious. Maybe there are culprits. I seeing as someone saw a big pile of timber by the hut near Sink Fell. You reckon those Turkin are stashing what they steal down there? Yes, yes. Well, I guess we're not getting some... I guess we're getting somewhere, not bad. You think you could check this hut out? Uh, maybe we'll get to the bottom of those Turkin's tricks. Rex, shall we get to work on this right away? Yes. You by my side, Pyra? I'm up to any challenge. Oh, I'm not... Knew I could count on you. Watch your back out there. Okay, so it's down over there, apparently. 
So, let's see here. All the way over there. Alright then. Go to the grotto, I suppose. It's the easiest way to get there. We're here! Are we? So, shall we? Come out, come out! Right, we may as well get the stuff while we're here. Hot orange! What have we here? I know quite a bit. Who am I? I didn't know that was gonna happen. Okay, question is can I jump off the side and get down to where I want to? Probably not. Okay. There's somewhere to like glide down. That'd be nice. Just sort of like, wee, off we go down the side. It would be lovely. It's not that far down, that's the thing. No! I thought I had that turned off. Hand. It's like, ooh, There we go. Lovely. Oh, nearly. Nearly screwed it up straight away. Oh, it's still quite far, isn't it? Oh, I say we should be right there, but I saw huh. something here. Okay. I mean, I was on top of the the thing, but all right. Hey, can I ask you about something? Uh, who are you? Uh, no, no person. You come for Reese Steelwood? Think so? I have a break a dream, no good, can allow. Only one thing for do. Fight me fighting. Alright then. We'll see how this works for you. A bike just went out by outside, in case you're wondering. Could no! be, it was a very big noise. No! I'm Alright, so let's see how this works out yeah! for us. Are you saying anime? Like, up. anime! Sure. Anime! Oh, for some reason, I don't know. It's very strange that you're saying that. There's frogs down there. I've never seen these frogs before. Eagle Eye! Eagle Eye? I like your attitude. Ooh! Gotcha! Defense protocol activated! Yeah. <laughs> I love her! Sort of like no emotion delivery of things. We make a good team. Go on, raise us some more. Yeah, so that should be it done for that, shouldn't it? Alright then, so let's fast travel. Back to the uh, timber site. Should be pretty much done then, if we've resolved this situation. We're here! And here we so, are! Huh. Shall we? I'm back! Ah, you made it back in one piece, good to see. So, what did you find? The Tor explained. So it was the Turkin. I should have known. And you say they dropped a carving. Hand it over, let me have a look. Yes, yes. Ah, amazing. So detailed, I've never seen work like it. It takes a real love and respect for your materials to make carvings like this. I never knew the Turkin had it in them. Hang on, I just had a great idea. Working more a Dane would pay a fortune for something like this. All we gotta do is buddy up with the Turkin, give them the lumber, and have them carve it. Great idea or what? Just depends. Oh, what am I saying? You already, uh, took out the Turkin who did this, didn't you? Oh, no, sorry. No, it's fine. You you did what I asked you to do. Tell you what, take this carving over to the accessory shop in Torikov. I'll let Rina know you're coming. If anyone can make something good out of this, it's her. Much thanks. I should be the one thanking you. It's a proper relief to know we don't have to worry about these thieves anymore, but mixed feelings and all. Indeed, indeed. Alright, so let's head over to the shop then. So, we want Torikov. And we'll look over the arch. It's probably quicker than the other thing, but the arch will do. Loading. We're here. Are we? So, shall we? I guess we shall. So we've got these quests here that I I, I I want to do these quests, but it's very much like, yeah, we'll 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 wait until we've got Naya back. Assuming we do get Naya back, we don't want you. We want this one. Tucker told me you lot were coming. You're looking to have a carving turned into an accessory, right? Yes, yes. 
I'll hang on just a second. I'll get started on it right away. This carving is something else. Beautiful. Definitely not human made. Not seen this nervous crafting. S what? I've not been this nervous crafting something in a long time. Whoever made this is a real master. And they're dead. Well, here you go. Take good care of it, okay? Avian totem carving. Quest complete. Alright then. So I think it's time we head to an inn. Let's see about getting this extra XP, etc. So is there an inn here? That's the question. I don't know. That's the only thing. I'm assuming there is, but I don't know where it is. And I don't want to go off exploring, finding places to find it, etc. It could be right over there. It's right over there. I see it. I see it. It's, I, I saw the counter and was like, that's it. Right, yes, yes, yes. Right, so short rest. Get our lovely XP. See, Gramps? I'm getting better. You did. More, more strong now! There we go. Lovely. Yes, I finished leveling up. Right, so that's us done for this part then. In the next part, we'll go back to the main story once again, pick up Neonaya, and then do some quests once we've got her, I suppose. Depends what happens in the story, you know. You know. Right, so Fur of Master Pun is ruffled. Engage comb protocol. Meh <sighs> meh. Tora dreamed about tasty sausage the size of Poppy. I would actually love some sausage. Oh no, get some. Yeah, I'll see you in the next part. Ta-ta for now. Hmm.